What actually happens if DACA goes away, and then what is your plan? Well, Josh, uh, first and foremost, I swore an oath to the Constitution, and I represent the citizens of the United States of America, not DACA recipients. And I also represent our district that bleeds in strong borders. We've had over 5 million people illegally invade the United States of America since Joe Biden became president. Fentanyl is now the number one cause of death in young people from 18 to 45, and they are using Narcan every single day in northwest Georgia, which, by the way, is not next to the border of Mexico. Because of this border crisis, it has caused a human uh, human security crisis like we've never seen before. Joe Biden and his administration is the greatest business partner to the Mexican cartels that we have ever seen in United States history. The only thing that I'm going to do to represent Northwest Georgia and Georgia's 14th district and the workers and the businesses there is to legislate and vote so that they have a strong economy, they have job opportunities that will not be stolen by people that are illegally invading our country to steal their jobs. I know that I know the representative you're talking about is probably Casey Carpenter, who seems to be more interested in representing illegal aliens than the up. legal citizens yeah. of Northwest Georgia. Thank you.